a breach. The men are wavering. All right, what is up, my fellow Trojans? We're back here with part 15 of our Galatian campaign. Okay, in last episode, we were struggling to defeat Carthage here. Or defeat Room, I'm sorry. So I'm just going to go ahead and, you know, we're going to lose a lot of our fleets doing this. But we have to back up these Roman fleets here because... They are going to cause a lot of issues if they just hamper us in here at Thapsis. Alright, so we're just going to go ahead and take the L. Alright, so we took the L. And for now, we need to tear down some of these buildings that are taking up all of our food. Okay, so we're going to dismantle some of these buildings. We're going to turn this to a horse pens. Probably should get a shrine of Taoists here for some more Celtic influence. Let's go ahead and get another Fisherman's Wharf. Let's upgrade this so we can get some better ships. Okay. And up here, I've kind of been thinking about this campaign, guys. I'm just going to abandon our holdings up here in Thrace. Okay, because we're going to have to start building an army over here. Just in case if they want to try anything. Go ahead and get two Cappadocian Lancers. Things are going decent. We gotta put down that slave rebellion ASAP. Gaul is mother to us all. Ooh, those would be nice. Late Libyan infantry. Hmm. Should they replace our Judeans? We do have enough spears. But what do we not? We can't tear that down yet. Okay. Well, let's get two of those guys. Let's fire the Judeans. Because we have enough spears in this army. Let's just go and get two... Uh, Late Libyan infantry. Let's go and turn. Actually, no, we gotta build up more another fleet. Oops. Where do we have that? It was in Alexandria, I believe. Yes. Let's raise a fleet. Let's get two heavy raiders. These guys are pretty good ramming ships. Let's get four heavy raiders for now. We'll end turn. See, yep, good thing we pulled out because we just couldn't have beaten that army. That army is pretty elite. They have no cav though, which is disappointing. Romans with no cav. So they took Neosis. Looks like they pulled back to Carthan. Hmm. 
We we'll have to stop a slave revolt from happening again. Because if they that happens behind our lines where we don't have a full stack, that's going to be extremely problematic. I mean, I, I don't think the slaves end up occupying settlements. I could be wrong. I think they just sack them. But then that ruins public order, and then that leads to revolts. Athens is pushing hard against Pergamon. Pergamon better do something. I know they have two full stacks sitting up here in Thessaly. They need to do something. Maybe shouldn't have got. I should have gotten that uh, confederation sooner. I just never thought that they would accept. I haven't had very much luck with confederations in my personal campaigns. Well, guys. Also, we've reached almost nine. We've reached 900 subscribers as of today. So, these new. People. I thank you guys for all the support. Um, yeah, finally, maybe can reach some monetization where you know can cover my costs for you know video editing software and such. Um, maybe start streaming a little bit. You know, if you guys want to donate, you guys can donate. If you guys don't want to, that's fine. Um, like I said when I made this channel, it's not really about making money for me. You know, it's just it's a hobby for me to you know share my total war and my love for total war with you guys. And I really do like doing commentary. Um, it just adds a lot of flair to the game, you know. Okay, Abello's returned home. Research complete infantry train mail. That's awesome. Food shortage, of course. Increasing rank, cool. Okay, well that's uh, definitely helping to cause a food shortage right there. So we're gonna send this army up to deal with that rebellion. Okay, I don't want this army to participate, so pull them out. Just handle them along with the garrison. Didn't lose any units, so that's good. We're gonna ransom the captives. Alright, so now we're going plus in food, that's good. Send them south. Cool, cool. That helps with public order by pulling that fleet out. Can we patrol? Yes, we can't, it's just hidden. So we'll patrol. And move into the other side of Carthage. Have them patrol as well. Get this spy moving. Have them stop them, hopefully from moving. You suck. You suck too. Okay, stop with the advice. Okay, so we're recruiting this fleet here. It's ramming ships. Also get a medium assault raider. Let's get some slingers in there. Okay, so what the infantry train mail get us? Oh, armor and weaponsmith, that's why we were doing it. Right. Okay, where did we have those? I don't think anywhere, actually. Alright, well. We have to get some settlements, we can do it. Let's go ahead and get a barbarian village. Let's tear that down. Uh, I think we should do large defenses. Let's do that. Let's get this fleet kind of away from the Roman fleets. Pergamon, you're besieging Athens. Okay. Okay, that's good. It looks like you and Athens are going to switch spots. Bithynia. Okay, we're still recruiting an army here. Let's move them down towards Antioch. Okay, so they can recruit some better infantry units. Put you in a patrol stance. Gotta take that fleet down there. Okay, let's patrol this army. Oh, get some more public order. But we're gonna get this fleet down here and we're gonna use them to come take out this, hopefully, this pirate fleet and give them some XP and also give some XP to the Admiral. And then maybe send, then we're gonna send them over here towards Carthage so they can help maybe contest some of the Roman fleet the fleets in the area. Okay, so we're gonna move Ships to Thapsis. We are getting that. Actually, let's get them down here into the Horn a little bit. Into this little bay. Alright, we need to replenish before we move on Carthan, so let's go ahead and turn. Oh, we got a skill to give out. How can I assist you? Let's give them more food. Commercial simulation and 
another negative one percent empire maintenance all right so i've been thinking hold on turn real quick so i've been thinking i don't think occupy numidia i don't think province is our own simply because obviously with our imperium level increasing our empire maintenance is going to skyrocket okay and we still have to conquer uh sicily you know magna gracia and italy in order for us to win this so that's going to be raising our imperium enough as it is it's going to be almost doubling our territory as an empire as the Keltoy Empire, as the Celtic Empire in the East. Um, so yeah, I don't think I'm going to hold Numidia. I don't know really what my tactic is. I'm probably just going to liberate them, try and create a buffer state. So that way, if the Roman troops... And also, I'd be protecting Carthage, if you think about it, because then Rome couldn't march their armies through North Africa to go and assault the Carthaginian North African holdings. So... Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do here, and we'll see how it works. So we're just going to kind of free Carthan, and I might go down and free Capsa. And then from there, that should shut down their route of expansion that way. We seek Ooh, tits trade and, and prosperity trade for agreement. all. Absolutely. Sure the Nasmones really need to march on Garama, because I'm not I willing to do that. They're a client state of Athens, and they want a defensive alliance. And if you pay me for one, absolutely. I'd absolutely love another ally to add to our list. Like, look how many we have. We got nine. And our elders see greatness in you. So we're finally replenishing. That's good. I thought we were. Yeah, we are. Cool. All right, let's go ahead and advance south with this army. Kind of give him next to Thapsis. All right, let's put him in a patrol stance. Okay, so our king is replenishing, but not enough to go and make any moves against that army there. We're going to get this spy because it's not even very good. It's not very good at all. We're going to go and see what's going on over here. And this spy, I want you to stop them from moving. You suck. Okay, whatever. Useless. So we're going to go about right there. Get up in a fortified position. Get them close up in a patrol stance. Right. Still not replenishing. It's fine. Fleet. Can't recruit anymore. What if we moved down this way? Into the Nile. Oh, we can't recruit units in the Nile. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, cool. Get this army down to Antioch. Start recruiting some Galatian legionaries. Get some archers as well. Nice. Nice elite archer squad we got right here. All right, so they, there's there's <laughs> Athens is besieging Pergamon and Pergamon's besieging Athens. Cool. All right, well this should be able to get us some heavy raiders. Nice, 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 nice. So we're gonna be able to move that fleet over. We gotta we gotta handle those pesky rebels. Hmm. Well, we can just recruit some more ships in there for the time being. Nah. Just go ahead and disband that fleet. 
Alright, it's going in turn. Marched on Thapsis. Well, looks like we lost an army. That sucks. Ouchie. Ouchie, ouchie, ouchie. Alright, well, that means we need to get that barracks up and going here in Carthage. Yeah, that army survives, but yikes. Okay. Well, we'll move a full stack down and take them out. I think that's Rome's first major victory over us it's fine everything's fine we got this Your generals might be the sons of Ares himself. I'm not joining in the war against Armenia. Sorry. I need to get a battle in here, guys. We got what 23 minutes left in the episode. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, Athens is backing up their city too. Uh oh. Come on, Pergamon. You're my most faithful ally yet. You're just gonna get destroyed like that? Not cool. Alright, military traditions. Turn home. Rebellion imminent in Thrace, of course. Okay, so only our Judean slingers survived that fight. Where's our... Okay, and they took where our barracks was being built. Awesome. Okay. Enemy fleet. Enemy fleet. Cool. So, we're gonna move it, this army. Actually, can King Medgrix just do it himself? We'll see. Yeah, easily. Yeah, just destroy that fleet. Get out of here, Rome. Thought you were slick. Let's go and get a warrior lodge and get another shrine of Tautus. Let's get in a defensive stance here. Ouchie, ouchie, ouchie. Okay, so we're gonna have to wait to recruit more units. That sucks. Okay, still can't get hardly any ships, which sucks. So we'll just get another heavy raider. Let me get some of these guys. Get two more slingers and a medium assault raider. And we're going to start moving on that pirate fleet. Rome, you are a difficult enemy. I will give you that. Start patrolling. Give me more campaign movement map range. Some indomitable infantry. And we'll give you wolves to the north. Let's continue this by moving this way. See what's going on. Alright. Over here. We can finally start recruiting some different troops. So we're going to keep three of these Thurios spears and get some legionaries of course just need to get two more cav units I guess we'll get one more Thurio spear one in turn
have taught the wise woman and all speak of a treaty, and our elders see greatness in you. Hmm. Yeah, I'll accept it. Why not? I'll take money where I can get it. The skill of mm, no, your generals. Definitely not. I got enough enemies. Rome is enough. I can't go to war with Sparta too. Higher bodyguards. Ooh, no! Not the Odysseans. No. Athens! You will get yours. You will get yours. Ooh, Sanctuary of the Great Gods? I didn't know that was one of the wonders. No, Pergamon. No. No. Guys, Pergamon's destroyed. Oh no. This is not good. This is not good at all. Rome has conquered all of Greece. We need armies. We need. Good thing we're building that army. Bithynia, you're gonna have to help out. Okay, okay. Get another heavy raider. Okay, get one more slinger, two more medium raiders. Ready for orders. Okay, this is not good, boys. Things are looking very dangerous for us here. Let me just cancel this army. Don't really need it, to be honest. Public order is going decent. Okay, not good. It's a very dangerous situation we got ourselves in here. Let's go and fire these mercs. Freeze up money. We can get maybe another full stack to uh, help hold up here. I mean, Bithynia is pretty strong, but are they going to be strong enough? That's the question. All right, let's go ahead and turn. How much time we got left? Oh, that's tragic, guys. Pergamon gone. Rome advancing with impunity in Greece. Oh, no. Good thing we're recruiting that army. I know I've said that before, but thank God. Things are going to about to get very salty. We might lose. We might get completely destroyed. Now we got to defend Galatia and Cappadocia. Defend our empire in our holdings in Syria. Uh oh, we come to that pirate fleet. Hopefully, our fleet can uh, counter them. We'll have to see. Non aggression our pact. If you pay me. Spoken. Nope. Bithynia is our last great ally that we can count on. Depots. Plus five lows, that's that's nice. Okay, we're spies back. Let's go to Carthan, see what's going on. They moved. I don't know where that probably in Capsa. Don't trust them. Probably should go free Capsa, so let's do that. Okay, can we hit Capsa now? We can. Okay, let's free Capsa. First, we're gonna sack it. 
you do not capture the settlements. Thank God. Next turn. Oh, thought we'd have more movement at range. Hopefully they don't have an army anywhere close, and then we can liberate it. This army start advancing. Actually, we probably should keep them here in Carthage, honestly, just in case Rome tries to send a fleet to capture it. That fleet right there. Might try to make some more moves against us. Siren, you're next to useless. So are you, Nasmones. Supposed to be my allies and helping me out, but you're next to worthless. Let's move the the, our fleet up to Tyros. I live to serve the people of and get some more medium raiders. These guys might be better. So we'll just fill out our fleet with these guys. What, what else can we get, actually? Yeah, we'll fill it out with these ramming ships. And one of these guys. Next turn, we should be able to take out that pirate fleet. Still recruiting this army here. What else do we need? Two more cab units and a special unit. I'm gonna get chariots. If we upgrade that, but we can't get any more infantry, so we're just gonna get that, it's fine. Bithynia is recruiting more troops. They got two full stacks right here. They're going to go to war with Rome. They're going to march on our behalf. Are they still at war with Rome? Yes, they are. Awesome. Okay, target Rome and Pella. All right, let's go ahead and turn. Warriors can get more elephants. Cool. Let's go ahead and turn. Minutes left. I don't think we're going to get an ep another battle. So, so it's going to be two episodes with no battles. It's rough. Okay, of course they're going to come try to take Lapoy. Yep. God, I hate these fleets. Alright, well they took Lapoy. So then we can do about that. Titsumeshi are marching on Garama. That's good. Alright, yeah, they took Lapoy. Ouch. We don't have a full stack of So we're just gonna have to let them have it. And then once that fleet hands the Cilicians, we're gonna send our fleet into action. That's fine for now. Hopefully Bithynia confirms our war target. Rhodos, what are you doing? Why are you down there? Make no sense. I haven't even checked on that province, honestly. We probably should do that. Alright, pirates, you've met your match. You have met your match. Thank you, Cyrene. Finally doing something. Athens eventually, hopefully, will go to war with... Rome, that'd be nice. Greeks finally standing together against the Latin. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. Let's... Oh no. We're gonna take some casualty, that's fine. No! We lost some very good cav. We're gonna liberty liberate. Get out of there. Awesome. Well, we lost a cat, a good cab unit. All right, so we're gonna have to just build that real quick. Our men are getting worn down. Need to get some military buildings in the area. Let's go down and hit those pirates. The pirates are running, so that means we can obviously beat them. So let's send the fleet back up there. Can actually, beat them pretty well. Only 49% lost. Okay, we'll ransom the captives, sink the pirate fleet. I live to serve the Send the fleet back down to Egypt. 
Okay, get two more of those ramming ships or two more medium assault raiders. Get this army moving up here, back into Galatia. Should probably just get two more Cappadocian Lancers, honestly. And then we're going to get a chariot. Keep patrolling. Let's go try to free Kurthan if we can. Alright. Probably should fight this, honestly, so we don't take too many casualties. Don't lose any units. So this will be the battle for the episode. Ooh, they didn't sally out. That's rare. So to assault this town, we're just going to use our Galatian Legionaries, okay, as the main line. Okay, have our missile troops behind. We're going to have three Galatian Spears here. We're going to have four Naked Spears as a flanking force, okay, along with two Cav units. Keep our Cappadocians here. And there we go. Advance. Oh, they're advancing on us. Okay, cool. They're going to try to come out. Try to get this hill if we can. Get our missile troops moving up. Get our Celted Naked Spearmen moving this way, actually. Keep one in reserve. Two moving out. We're not going to be able to take that time. So right now we're going to hold here. Skirmishers here. Celts, go around. Defensive formations. Cappadocians, charge the general. Get these naked spears moving in. Harass them with these horses as well. Celts, legionaries, what you doing? Ethiopians, target them, target them. Naked Spears can only advance up this way. Skirmishers get back. Galatian Legionaries should make quick work of these Italian Town Guards. Should be an issue. I think. If we can target them. That'd be awesome. General's almost dead. For our ancestors. That cab unit's pretty much done for. I really like those Galatian Legionaries, like a lot. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Oh, Jesus. Charge them down. Get Cappadocians over here. Get these naked spearmen moving up into here. Formation. We're gonna completely surround this inf these infantry here. These Cappadocians moving up. Hold your fire, Ethiopians. Get around, get around. 
Yep, they're breaking. Legionaries have uh, done their work well. Just charge in, get a nice flanking charge in here on this infantry. Okay, we shattered in there. Here comes the naked spearman. Get one Galatian legionary to come up. They will bleed for us, horsemen. Charge them in. Spears, Galatians. I want the Galatian legionaries to get all the kills, get them leveled up so they can go head to head with the Roman infantry units. We're gonna get a nice charge in here. Charging against his Italian swordsman. Throw Pelum. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Ethiopians, what are you doing? They're not being combat, son. Throw and throw javelins as well. Charge him in. Fast forward. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Galatian legionaries are charging in. Taking some heavy casualties from those jabs. That's fine. Our naked spearmen are moving in to flank them. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Three hundred twenty-five kills. That's good. Go ahead and get all that XP that you can. Fast forward. Going in battle. Let us liberate them as well. I'm not even going to try to sack it. I'm just going to liberate it and get my forces out of there. Okay, so this will be the end of the episode, guys. I know I'm sorry it wasn't super eventful. Um, didn't get any good battles in against Rome. But we did manage to create a barrier here, okay, for them to not attack us. Therefore, it is going to allow us to replenish here, regroup, get three full stacks with a decent navy, and we're going to start pushing in against Kragas. And I guess it was kind of eventful because now we have to start watching our territories in Galatia and, uh, and just um, Asia Minor. Alright guys, I will see you guys in part 16. Parry the Trojan out.